what's up guys it's 2016 that means you're gonna get new energy new videos to tackle uh -huh, uh -huh. so if you read the title of this video you know that i'm gonna be teaching you how to dress like kanye on a budget because let's just be honest if you're a fan of kanye and kanye's fashion which you probably are because you're watching this video Kanye's fashion line is very overpriced it's like a thousand dollars for a sweatshirt with holes that you could just you know like get at a thrift store or like make yourself i'm going to show you some items i have that are my most kanye-esque items i'm going to tell you where i got them and i'm even going to rock a few for you so let go i'm going to start with what i'm wearing right now which is uh normally i wouldn't wear olive on top of olive but i was just feeling green today <laughs> like my bank account <laughs> anyway <laughs> i was just feeling green today and i decided to pair this look so what this is is a olive bomber that i actually got from macy's yes guys macy's has some like low-key uh you know kind of swaggy stuff that you might actually like and i got this bomber from macy's i really like this one because it's not too bulky and it's really easy to layer with because it's not so bulky um it looks good it feels good it's kind of like a squishy material but you know that's cool and i layered this bomber with this shirt i got from h&m oh the bomber was like 30 dollars, so that's your first deal $30 in comparison to like 500 I got this sweatshirt, uh, classic crew neck sweatshirt from H&M. Uh, it was $15. You know, it's good for layering and I really like this color. It has some like distressing in the sleeves kind of. Very similar to like the long line cuts that Kanye has and uh, $15 at H&M. You cannot really argue with that. Okay guys, item two that I want to show you is a sweater I got from Forever 21. Uh, it's actually this knit sweater, uh, kind of classic stitching, I guess. I don't even know what you would call that. But uh, classic that, and um, it's a very nice sweater. Again, it's really good for layering. You always see Kanye layering, and I think that's the key to his style, is layering. And you remember, I showed you the bomber jacket in the beginning. That's kind of what you want to go for, just stuff that you can use to layer. Um, grays and olives seem to be really popular in his collection, and that's what you're going to stick with. So this is how I would wear the sweater. Um, just a nice layer under the olive blazer. Again, you want to, you know, maybe stick the sleeves out a little bit. Get super Kanye-like, you know, maybe pose. No, probably don't do that. You look like a douchebag. This fit and this sweater actually only cost $14. Again, Forever 21, check it out. The bomber was 30. Macy's, check it out. Let's go on to the next fit. Okay, guys, this next item is from PacSun. This is the most uh, expensive of the shirts I'll show you. Uh, I got this from PacSun, like I said. It's on the bias or on the bias, whatever, however you pronounce it. Um, it's just this crew neck sweater it actually has like an American uh whatever like a some sort of geometric print on the side I wish they would have done without it and just kept it like a classic tan shirt but that's what the bomber is good for it's great for layering like I said in Kanye's collections it's olive gray tan black so this is definitely cool for layering and achieving your Kanye look of course and uh like I said you could just push out the sleeves like so this cost me I want to say it was like $25 or $30, but Paxton always has some sort of deals. And if you're a GSOM member, you get points, which translate to dollars and you could save and, and we're all just saving. Like we're, gosh, man, I love America. This is another item that I received. Uh, I purchased this at H&M. I'm pretty sure it was either 10 or $15. Get a lot of compliments on this one as well. Um, can wear it the same way I've worn this shirt and the two others. Um, just a cool long line shirt. It says you're too close. You can just layer this. It's great for layers. It also looks really cool with plaids and such. So 
Yeah, yay for long lines. You rarely see Kanye wearing, uh, like, flannels and stuff. But when he is, he's always pairing them with, like, a light denim and, like, a plain shirt, uh, elongated shirt. So if you're going to go the... If you're gonna go the flannel route, I do recommend Paxton because they have a really nice selection of flannels there. My personal favorite is Modern Amusement. They have some really great flannels. This is my favorite one. You got the olive, you got the maroon, you got some yellow, you got some white. This flannel, I believe, cost me, I think it was like $20 or something or $25, but again, I got it through Paxton and I'm a GSOM member, so points, it all adds up. Good stuff. So the last two top items I'm going to show you guys are hoodies. Um, everything is pretty much about long lines and such, so if you can stick with that and find things of that nature, you'll pretty much be set. This is a long line hoodie I got from H&M. I believe it was. I actually got a really good deal on this. I think it was like, it might have been like. 10 or $5 at the end of my purchase, H&M had a sale, as they always do. Um, it's just this gray hoodie that has these side zips. I get a lot of compliments on this. I got one just yesterday, so you know it's real. You know it's legit. Well, if you're watching this video, it's not yesterday, technically. But you know what I mean. A lot of people think, oh, well, you know what, I don't want to shop at H&M, or I don't want to shop at... Forever 21 because I don't want to like be wearing the same clothes as everyone else their popular stores blah 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 guys it's not about whether you have the same shirt pants jacket hair eyes whatever as someone else it's about how you rock it so if you rock this you could rock this like you're you're the only person who has this you could rock this like the Yeezy season one season two season 3000 so this other hoodie I got is actually from Forever 21. Um, I prefer H&M over Forever 21 only because they seem to be leaning more towards the street style fashions and trends and like Forever 21 is like trying to slowly catch up. So yeah, just my opinion. Don't hate. Leave it below in the comments. What do you like more? Forever 21 or H&M? So this is a black hoodie I got from Forever 21. This again cost me like $14 or something. It's good for layering. Um, sometimes I wear it with this, sometimes I wear it with, uh, like a leather coat, but now that I'm looking at it, I feel like you could totally do something with this, this, and this. I don't know. Okay, guys, now we're gonna move down to bottoms. We're gonna talk about some of the bottoms that you could wear to dress like Kanye on a budget. All of these jeans are super, super dope, super cool. Um, I'm going to compare some of my pricier jeans with some of the more uh, economically friendly priced jeans and you'll see that either way you could rock them both cool. My first two comparisons are these Gap jeans I got. They're the, uh, these are actually women's 1969 high-rise skinnies. I love these jeans. I love the way they fit. They fit awesome. I like I, oh, excuse me. <laughs> I like skinny jeans that actually fit like true to size in that I wear these jeans, it's not incredibly tight on my thigh areas, it's just like slender and then it comes down to a nice fitted bottom. Those are the type of skinny jeans I have. So if you are like me, I would recommend the Gap. Um, Kanye wears light denims, often distressed denims. These jeans, like many Gap jeans, was like $70, but it was so worth it. If you have one pair of Gap jeans, you're like, you'll have it for the rest of your life. You can give it to your kids, your girl, your guy, whatever. We're all just sharing jeans. All right, so these jeans are actually a similar wash to these, except I got these from H&M. Uh, I actually got these really freak uh, recently. Uh, these were $20, I got them on sale. These are a skinny fit as well. These fit super cool. I roll the ends of these. These look really good with um, all of my long line tops and they just have a really nice skinny fit as well. So look, $20, $20 pair of jeans, $70 pair of jeans. They both look pretty similar. Either way, you could rock them both and get a little Kanye-esque. So these are the 1969 skinnies as well. 
resolution true skinny eyes you know like whatever they're skinny jeans um i like these because these have holes in them i don't know if you can make it out but they do have holes in them um these fit really cool too you see kanye in kind of like distressed clothing um super super dope like I said, these are pretty pricey. I think these were 60 or 70 as well, but they fit amazing. I've had these and they haven't failed me. They're actually my favorite jeans to wear and uh, I really don't care what season it is. I'll rock these in the winter, which is technically what it is now. So yeah, super dope. Okay, on this end, these are two jeans that I got from Zara. Uh, the first pair I got were these gray skinny jeans. Um, Zara jeans are okay. Honestly, I think they're a bit overpriced for the quality. Um, these jeans are cool. I do like wearing them occasionally, but the only reason why I don't like them is because I feel like they're almost too tight fitting in the thigh area. But they do look nice. They're high fashion, I guess. A little bit too pricey. These were $80, so yeah. On the contrary, then I got these black jeans from Zara, which I actually really do like, so I'll probably just get darker colors from Zara from this point on. They have this like pleated moto look going on, they fit skinnies, very, very kanye -esque. Some form of Oxfords, I wear these Oxfords, they're made by Ugg, they're super comfortable. I get tons of compliments on them and apparently I can't hold them either. So yeah, Uggs, these were like a hundred and change, but you know. H&M Forever 21, you can definitely come to there. Last, guys, is my Nike Roche Run, which we all know Kanye loves Nike, <laughs> not really. But I really like these sneakers, they're super comfortable, uh, I wear these all the time, they're just great shoes, so, yeah. Actually, uh, another pair of kicks that are really cool are the Adidas Tubulars, they have them in, like, black, uh, tan, like an olive color, they're just super cool, I hope to acquire some soon, so I would definitely rock those for that kanye look, okay? Actually guys, you just need to be confident in what you're wearing, obviously Kanye West is a very confident, secure person, well from what we see at least, and he seems to know exactly what he's doing, but you can also emulate these looks and look, you know, super fresh, and save a penny, like you don't have to break bank just to look like these celebrities, you know, just shop smart, shop wise, and be confident. Leave a comment below if you have one, uh, subscribe, like, let me know if you have any questions, tell me what your favorite brand is, H&M Forever 21, would you pay for like a Yeezy clothing item, you know, so let me know down below and I'll see you in the next video, peace.